What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. All right now, folks, how you doing? Mr. Warmack, and I'm definitely in the building. You saw the intro, you saw who it was, so let me get out here and do my little, my little spiel. Give you smuck my two cents on things. Today I'm talking about what we, we celebrated Father's Day a couple weeks ago, and, uh, and, and as always, these bitter ass chicks that you know. Well, let me tell you, let me tell you what it is. It's bitter chicks and the fun. It's the fun. It's dysfunctional chicks dealing with dysfunctional dudes. That's the bottom line preface. Now, I was, you saw, I was on my Facebook. I saw the usual chicks didn't cry about Happy Father's Day to mother. Oh, I'm the mother, I'm the father, blah, blah, blah. Let me tell you the average chick who uh, celebrates this. And you know I'm not lying, because you see it yourself. The average chick who celebrates this pays 50, 50 bucks a month or less for rent or a home. The average chick who celebrates this pays no electric or gas. The average chick who celebrates this gets wick. It's food stamps, i.e. they're on the government dime, which means, i.e. they're on my back. And, and to have the stones to cry about something, how hard you work, when you don't work first of all, I should be crying because how hard I'm working for you. And there was, this, there was a, I was on Facebook, like, I don't know, the groups, like I said. Well, I'm probably supposed to the about, um, this topic and then all of a sudden like most of these chicks are bitter because they picked some messed up dude and that's a lot of the point I'm trying to get across that I was trying to get across there you pick these dudes don't get mad now you can't say this dude was a bum after you had three kids with him well guess what if he was a bum what do you think you are you're a bum because it's like whenever he was saying something to get between them legs and you let him. So how, how can he be a bum on a son after three dudes, after three chicks, I mean three kids, and he moved on? And secondly, I don't know the whole story, so I, I look at you're both dysfunctional, and that's how it is. Like I said, and then all that, and then, then you had the old, uh, the old typical tap dancers. Oh, you must be mad, you must not take care of your kids because you're mad. No, it's just the common sense part of it, it's ignorant. It's all, it's ignorant. But like I said, in, in the black community, ignorance is embraced by a, a lot of people. Not everybody, but by a lot of people. And then they wonder why they get talked to like they get talked to. Because like I said, how you gonna say, like, I don't celebrate Mother's Day. I don't, what, 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 what sounds stupid? But like I said, ignorance is embraced a lot in the black community. You know, it's the only place that's embraced is like people walking with their pants hanging down and they gotta hold their pants while they're walking. And I'm thinking, buy a fucking belt, dude. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, it's, a, it's this dysfunctional women, insecure dysfunctional women picking dysfunctional dudes and then they're reproducing. And I, and I made a quote in the group also, if you want these chicks that are celebrating that, and I know you're one of these chicks getting all this government money, your kids, you write me an inbox saying Happy Father's Day because I'm paying for everything. And that's when they, that's when the proverbial shit hit the fan because then it was all over. And they like like they were like, well, why are you mad? So I'm not mad. I'm just, I said, I have a problem with the ignorance going on here. Because so I said, really? I said, you want to celebrate both? Like, I can care less about your situation, about your status. But and like I said, at the end of the proverbial day, you pick this guy. He said something, and, 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 if, and if that's the case, then he must not be the only one who cracked the safe. So sometimes you know, sometimes you saw great stuff, you have to look in the mirror. You have to look and see, well, this may not be good for me to do. You can, and then when you do it afterwards, because nowadays I'm finding out a lot of black people, thank God, Allah, Yeshua, whoever you believe, are calling out this trifling shit. 
more and more black people are standing on the same look, man. You guys are making us look bad. And I'm, I'll say it any time of the week. It's like people, people who want to, people who are uh, on Facebook all day, don't have no job, yet won't ask me for money. Fuck out of here. So, I'm proud that black people are standing up for that. But that's the average chick who celebrates this stuff. It's a dysfunctional chick and a dysfunctional dude. They get together, they create dysfunctional kids. So, I'm out with that. Peace.